Hi everybody, it's Dr. Magnifico from jerryspilvet.com. This is Rosie. We did a video on her not too long ago. Um, she was found in someone's lawn. We suspected by a car because she had a pelvic fracture. Um, we did a video on her three days post-op, um, and this is her three weeks post, well, post being hit by car. I can't even say post-op. Um, post being hit by car, and this is her. So she has been in a cage, resting at home, inside, and she is now up and walking. I, I say it all the time, cats really are little miracles if you just give them a chance, and she is certainly not falling short of that. Um, she had multiple pelvic fractures, and we were really worried initially about her ability to urinate and defecate. Um, she stayed resting in a cage for about a week and then went um, back home to live in a big cage, and she's on very strict cage rest, but now that she's up and walking, she's doing really well. So at this point, it's just giving her another couple of weeks, five more weeks is what we say, um, to let that pelvis heal completely. She can come out and walk around as long as she's supervised, and then she needs to be left in a crate when she's not being supervised so that she doesn't try to jump on anything or fall down anything. But this is what the miracles of cats are all about. And when we say that cats come with nine lives, we literally mean it. They will, even from the most awful um, fractures and accidents, they will walk and do really well. So this is Rosie at three weeks out.